Hi, I'm Bea. My channel is about mixed media, art, journaling, assemblage, and anything else that sparks my interest. Heyo, welcome to my next project for Art Foamies. I'm gonna use the stamp from Sarah Matthews and one from the Rebecca Meyer Design. I also gonna use the stamp body, I'm gonna use it to put the paint on. I have printed on those uh, sticky papers some letters which I'm gonna use later. We're gonna need some palettes. I use old lids, food lids. I just need something to mix paint with the textile medium. I use a palette knife. Those paints, as you can see, and as I said, the textile medium. I have this old linen, bed linen fabric, which is uh, really a vintage piece. I did turn some of them into a towel size, added here a little hanging thing and I want to stamp on it. And I want to use it as a hand towel because I need to wash that. That's the reason why I use this time a textile medium. There are several different brands out there. Just go look around what you have. If you want to wash your piece, you, I recommend using a textile medium. Uh, Following the instructions, I'm gonna mix two parts of paint with one part of medium, but that might vary from brand to brand. So first I'm gonna mix some colors and, well, I'm not gonna measure it, I just eyeball it. I'm going to start with the lightest color with stamping. That's probably more than what I need. And then I mix it. So my next step is I'm going to cut out my letters. And I want to use them as a resist. That's why they have to be sticky. Let's start. Removing the release paper. I try to touch as less as possible the sticky side so that the glue is not getting less gluey, so to speak. Okay. I'm making sure that I have a really good contact to the fabric so that the paint can't seep in under too much. There's going to be probably some seepage but I try to have as less as possible and somewhat straight would be nice too. Okay. Now I'm gonna need my stamp buddy and I'm gonna load the paint onto the stamp buddy. 
Remember it is a mixture between fabric medium and I'm using craft paint, you could use any kind of acrylic paint you have on hand. So this is my lightest color, so I'm going to start with that. Okay, now this has to dry 24 hours, but I'm gonna remove the papers already. It's a little bit lost in the whole thing, so I'm gonna go over with a postcard pen, which is an acrylic pen. Okay, now I hope you enjoyed this video. I will as usual have a photo from the product at the end of the video and I hope to see you soon again. Take care!